virtual trainer and master motivator here with 7dayfitness.com. And what I want to talk about and share with you folks is how to be actively involved in what you're doing. Whether it's your business, whether it's your relationship, whether it's with your family, with your relatives. And if you're not in active involvement right now, or if you feel that you're not getting the results, or you feel that you're not getting exactly maybe what you're pouring in, maybe you're not pouring in enough. And let me share, with, uh, share a story with you. You know, my, uh, a good relative of mine called me the other day and said, Wes, I'm trying to do so much to get to the top. You know, I'm doing this, I'm working hard, you know, I'm showing up early, and I talked to my manager, and he feels that I'm not ready to go to the next level. And I shared with him, I said, well, Wes, well, well, I'm not going to say his name, but I said, are you in active involvement? Are you doing the things, are you separating yourself completely from those things that are not productive in your life? Are you reading the books? Are you expanding your mind? Are you being educated? You know, a lot of us on a daily basis, we listen to the radio, we look at TV, and these things are unproductive tools that are tearing us down. Because I understand this is how the mind works. The mind absorbs everything, whether it be consciously or subconsciously. And when your mind absorbs these things, whether they're productive or not, those things have to exude. And, and, and see, let me share you with you. If I hang around with folks that are poor, if I hang around folks that have that poor mentality, let me say that, more than likely, I'm going to inherit that poor mentality. But folks, if I hang around and surround myself around folks that are rich, that are happy, that doesn't complain and blame other folks for things that are happening in their lives, before you know I start inheriting the attitude and the, the, the spirit that they have. Folks, I want to leave you with, you have to be in active involvement. I call it the 30-day mental fast. And a 30-day mental fast is separating yourself from some negative people. Reading from a book at least 15 minutes per day, something empowering. Separating yourself from the newspaper, from the radio, from TV. Actively getting engaged to exactly what you want out of life. I don't know if it's a car, it's a house, it's a good relationship, it's a, you know, a great wife, a great husband, great kids. You know, a better family, a better job. But this 30-day mental fast will cleanse your mind. And you will see how much time you do have. You know, all the time we say, well, I don't have enough time. But you have so much time when you separate some of those unproductive things out of your life. Hey, this is Wesley Virgin. Get fit with 